On any given weekend, they gather with their tools of the trade. And with a desire that doesn't diminish over the years, but instead grows stronger. We have been here since 1976 at Kaiser. We started 1971 at the UH. We compete all year. We have all ages from 30 on up. We compete in five-year age brackets. We prepare in Hawaii uh, with the UH track teams. We have helped coach, administer, uh, with, compete with the Junior Olympics for the last 40 years. These are just some of Hawaii's USA Masters track and field competitors, men and women, who want to challenge themselves and others in their same age groups, or maybe just try to recapture some of that magic from their youth. There wasn't that much magic in high school, but uh, it, it brings back some good memories and it's nice to be on your home track. I never threw in high school, so uh, this will be a little different, but I'm uh, pretty excited about being out here. The Masters Track and Field program offers a variety of competitive events for anybody 30 years of age and up, and all of it is fully sanctioned by the USA Track and Field Association, the governing body of the sport. We have programs in every city around the country, around the world. They have like 8,000 people at the World uh, Masters Championships. They're gonna be in Brazil next summer. Vince Costello got back into track and field after a 20-year hiatus. Now he's competing at the highest level in his age group. I've won the Nationals th three times, and uh, I hope to compete this year, uh, even in an international meet. There's a World Games in Italy in the summertime, so I hope to go there. Costello says he doesn't necessarily excel in any of the 10 events, but put them all together, then he can get the job done. I just moved into a new age group. Which is? I, I turned 60 a couple of days ago. And so, it should get easier. So now. yeah, it should. The uh, hurdles get lower, the shot put gets lighter, you know. So uh, even though you're aging, there's some uh, benefits to it. You, you look forward to being the young guy in your age group again. And it's not just a club for the boys. And we want more women to come on out. We have other women that do compete, but uh, Joan Davis is our superstar. Um, she's been in it for a long time, but we'd love to see more women come on out. But titles and medals aside, most of these competitors turn out simply for the joy of it. That's number one. That's why we're here, and we have a lot of fun. These guys are, I, I trained with them back in when I was in my 18s and 20s, so I thought it'd be exciting to come back when I turned 50, and this is the first meet after I turned 50, so here I am. <laughs> It's gonna be a long day. I, I went to sleep at nine last night. <laughs> <laughs> what do you have built tonight? Uh, just before, I, and my five hour energy is wearing off already. And so. it's only been 30 minutes. <laughs> and I just got here. <laughs>